Virgo, say hey, my lovies. I said Virgos. Hey, my lovies. You already know the vibes. I'm sending you a multitude of love, light, and positive energy. It's your spiritual guide, Empress Meek, and I am so grateful to have you all here with me. Thank you for all you do for our channel. Thank you for your likes, shares, and subscribes. All right, Virgo. So let's get into it. Hey, y'all. Hey. Talk to me in the comments. How are you guys doing? I missed you. All right, so let's see what's going on here. Right now, what you're looking at is your pre-shuffle. Um, I did pre-shuffle and did a quick spread for you to see what I should talk to you about this evening, what energy may be coming towards you. We've been doing a lot, so I'm just like, okay, let me get something and see what's going on with Virgo. What do I need to talk to them about? This freaking fire sign. Aries Leo Sagittarius is asking that you be patient with them. This says just a few more months, good things to come. Um, it says just a few more months, good things come to those who wait. All right. And then it's caught. And then, oh, you got a lot going on here. <laughs> All right. So patience is key for somebody here. And this fire sign wants you to be patient. And look right under that, we have caution. Find out more information. Don't overwork yourself. All right. So somebody be careful of that. And then somebody has a lost loved one that is watching over you. For somebody, you lost a fire sign. Somebody has a Leo that is watching over them. All right. I feel like it's a brother or a male. Manifest. Okay. We have um, tell the universe exactly what you want. And I feel like also this fire sign is trying to manifest you. I feel like this fire sign is trying to cleanse their energy. Ooh, what happened? Is my phone about to die? Hold on, y'all. Let me make sure my phone's not about to die. Okay, we good. All right, so yeah, this fire sign looks like they may be trying to manifest you back. Um, Tell the universe exactly what you want so you can get it. Um, I feel like for some of you, be specific about what you want so these same people will stop coming back in your energy. I feel like somebody here is sick and tired of being sick and tired of the same old folks. It's these same old folks, the folks that's not doing right. You're just like, no, 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 no. Let me go back to the drawing board, okay? Let me go see what I can brew up this time. <laughs> ah, be specific, guys. That's all. Just be specific about what ex exact, say exactly what you want. We have give it time, okay, everything in divine timing, let things flow. So some of you are trying to control what comes in, what time, how, and all that. No, just set it and forget it. Say exactly what you want. Make it clear to the universe, to God, through prayer, um, through manifestations, and then just let it go. Just wait. Just don't sit and wait, but just be an expectation while you're moving on about your life, making your life better. All right. Just a few more months and good things to come. Like, so don't worry. Just a few more months. I love this card. This is another um, deck, like a little, this little new deck. I think it's so cute. Um, I got two decks and pretty soon I'll be launching our cards. So I can't wait. I'm excited. You guys are going to love them. <laughs> All right. So um, I'm really excited about it. All right, so after give it time, we have date night. Get ready to be wined and dined. See, Spirit is trying to tell you to try to be patient, try to wait things out. You also had somebody in your energy saying that they want to take you out, but they don't, they can't right now. Somebody's having money trouble. You could know who that is, but somebody's going through a lot um, with financial situations here. And that person is like, they really can't do anything for you right now, but they want to. And I feel like it has something to do with that fire sign. Whoever this fire sign is for y'all, like somebody met a fire sign or they knew them and they came back. And this person is a trip. Like their energy is so, so they're masking their feelings for you. They really, really want you. They really, really like you. But for some reason, they're, I don't know, it's like a sense of false confidence or something. I don't know, but they, their head is big. It's like they, it's like something's making them so conceited. But, um... Anyway, we got spy here. Someone's got their eye on you. You are doing your research. All right, so some of y'all, you using your spy technique, okay? You can't touch a Virgo when they put that spy cap on to give them their magnifying glass and you done, okay? Somebody got the magnifier out because you want to know exactly what's going on with this person. They are too damn sneaky, okay? So you're on it. And then for some of you, this person is watching you like a hawk, like they're 
trying to keep tabs on you. Somebody is watching you. They're so like into everything you do. My God. Like, what is their problem? Like, mind your business. Okay, mind your business. Uh, but um, yeah. Somebody said, yeah, mind the business that pays you. That's right, Virgo. Get smart with them. Like, what are they minding our business for? <laughs> patience. Let's see what the patience part is. Spirit, show me through moonology what Virgo can expect. Show Virgo, please. Holy Spirit, Divine Spirit, Holy Angels, thank you so much for loving on us the way you do. Thank you for keeping us set apart, full of love and light and positive energy, making a difference in the world each and every day, even on our bad days, okay? Thank you so much, Spirit, for abundance and overflow, healing in every situation, healing through our hearts, minds, bodies, souls, and spirits, victory in every situation also. Thank you so, so much for the peace that passes all understanding and letting the anointing trickle down to each and every person that's watching and supporting me, that loves me for who I am. Thank you for letting the blessings flow from me to them. Amen, amen, and amen. Patience, please, for my Virgos. Hey, my lovies. Y'all want me to sing the song? Virgo, say my loves. Hey, hey, my loves. Hey, hey, my loves. Sing it with me one time. Sing. Hey, my loves. Hey, my loves. <laughs> All right, y'all. Come on, let's go. Don't. Okay, so the first card that came out is bring love into the situation patience just allow divine timing to come you just be your loving amazing self look good doing it virgo like you do okay mm -hmm. somebody got their hair did and i see it look cute i can't somebody got their hair out and you change the color somebody got long like <laughs> toilet hair it's like no <laughs> don't get me don't get me. i'm just playing <laughs> somebody got the super long tracks in. They got the super long. Somebody said, these ain't tracks. Well, bundles, whatever you want to call them. We call them tracks. I guess I'm old. I don't know, but I look good. <laughs> you can't tell my age. But yeah, we used to call them tracks, Sean. But whatever you got, it look good. Okay. Work it. Okay. <laughs> so don't let your past hold you back. This fire sign is your past. Don't let them hold you back. Don't let this person make you stuck. Don't keep believing what they say. They entangled, okay? And nobody want parts of their entanglement. Manifest, tell the universe exactly what you want so it comes to you. You guys are so busy working, you're not manifesting. You're not saying it. Write it down. Do something to put out there in the universe the type of partner you want. What would make you happy? What you feel like you need? What are your desires? You know? Luck is on your side when you're manifesting. So trust. Somebody said, who need luck when you just blessed? That's right. I know that's right. Who need luck when you blessed by the best? That's true. <laughs> but luck is on your side. This, this is just another way of saying God is on your side. The universe is on your side. Divine timing is at your fingertips. Okay. So give it time. Let's see why this is here. Um, Take time to breathe out. Okay, so this is like, don't hold your breath. Don't hold your breath. Just keep going, okay? Keep going because you not being worried about it and being unbothered and not even being concerned about it makes it come to you faster. It's like, oh my God, did she forget it? She forget she asked about this? You know, the universe starts moving on your behalf. Date night. Let's see. Get ready to be wined and dined. Woo. What about date night? Tell Virgo what they need to know about date night. Believe in the impossible and hold on to your vision, honey. So hold on to your vision, Virgo. And I'll probably put that in the comments. Hold on to your vision. Um, and it says believe in the impossible. Okay. Somebody is about to come and sweep you off your feet, male or female. Well, and you're going to have somebody to sweep off their feet, males. But believe in the impossible. Don't give up. Spy, you got somebody's attention big time, okay? Who is this spying on Virgo? Who's this spy? What do they need to know about the spy? Um, The energy is gaining momentum. No wonder. It's like it's at the bottom of the deck. All right, so the energy is gaining momentum when it has something to do with this spy. And adjustments are required to have what you want. This card is so pretty. 
that's really nice all right but let's move on okay so we got all that energy here so hold on to your vision virgo manifest exactly what you want set your set your intention and be specific about what you need and what would make you happy okay all right, let's go ahead and move on. Let's pull out some tarot cards for this energy. Somebody want, all right, let's, look, we can look at the feelings real quick. Let's be quick. Let's look at the feelings real fast. Okay. <clears throat> Somebody really likes these cards. I like them too. All right, let's get some feelings on this. I feel like this person is trying to get you to wait for them. Kind of almost feel like this person is, they're, first of all, they're a bad liar. And then they think that you believe everything they say. Why do they think that? It's like the type of person that will just lie, lie, lie straight to straight through their teeth until they're not around you anymore. Then all of a sudden they show who they really are. Show me this fire sign. Freedom, leap of faith, brand new opportunities. So I feel like this fire sign is coming towards you. They're not letting this go. Manifest. Tell the universe exactly what you want. We got transformation here. Somebody's undergoing a spiritual transformation. Also, Scorpio could be significant here. Somebody also is um, just transforming their life. You're manifesting. You're starting everything over. I hear all things new. Yes. Patience. Just a few more months. Oh, before you end this happy sun energy. We love it, don't we? We love this. So have patience. And then we have give it time. Also, you're getting clarity. You're feeling strength. You're feeling empowered, okay? Be patient. You're going to move into this energy. For some of you, somebody is like, when? I feel terrible. But that's only now. And don't say that. Say things are getting better for me as I speak. As I'm watching this, things are changing in my life. Like, say different things, okay? I don't speak lack and doubt. I never use those words hardly ever unless I have to say them to somebody or something. But to speak over my situations, I only speak life, words of power, words of encouragement. You know, you got to know your strength. You're a master manifester. It's power in your tongue. Just like you can use it to make somebody feel terrible, you can use it to bring in your heart's desires. You got to be wise about it. All right, past lack and suffering, give it time. So stop feeling bad about the past. Don't let the past hold you back. Somebody needs to really let their person go. All right, look, cycles, completion, and change. Time for that. It's time for that. Because you have this new energy coming in. Look, date night, believe in miracles, believe in the impossible. So that's coming in for you. Epiphany, you're about to find out something. A huge breakthrough moment is coming so you're going to be very happy at what happens. Who is this spy? What do they want? Who is this spy person? Spy? Why is the spy here for my Virgo? Okay. So it's somebody somebody that you could have met in the winter or last winter or there's going to be a, somebody wants a rebirth. Hmm. Maybe you're going to go through a rebirth or transformation. But who's the spy? It's a male. Masculine energy. Somebody who could be married or in a commitment or something like that. Contracts, career, commitments, you could work with this person. But this person wants to talk to you. Air, <laughs> Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, it could be an air sign, but somebody wants to talk to you. They've been spying on you. But this person is toxic and they know you don't want anything to do with them. So that's why if you're wondering why they didn't come out, that's why. Because they know you live your life a different way. They can't get over on you like they can get over on other people. And that's a huge issue for them. Mm-hmm. Yep, it sure is. It's a personal problem, too. That's right. <laughs> Somebody said it's a personal problem. Y'all be getting smart. Somebody said it's a personal problem. <laughs> anyway, who said that? Put it in the comments. All right, let's see. Fire sign. Let's see what Spirit wants to tell you. Spirit, show Virgo what they need to know about this energy. Let me see the time. Okay, perfect. We love it. All right, fire sign. Show me. Oh, okay. My deck in reverse. My bad. All right, so you got this fire sign. Knight of Wands energy here. Somebody thinking about you passionately. Somebody about to make their move, baby. And they trying to make it count. 
making their move and making it count, manifest. This fire sign is on the go all the time. Yeah, so somebody is queen of wands. Somebody's manifesting somebody sexy, a go-getter, fiery, all right, very attractive and very successful. This person is well-spoken, um, well sought after. Ooh. And I feel like, look at this, queen of wands and knight of wands. So it's a younger fire sign. And it could be with the older fire sign. But somebody here is younger, somebody's a bit older. Ooh. I had to open the window. Okay. Let me see. This sage got a smoky in here. Show me one on the fire sign. Male. A juggler. Okay. So two of pentacles. My cards are in the reverse. And then let me see the knight of wands. I mean the queen of wands. Okay. So somebody's secrets got exposed here. Or I feel like somebody. Hmm. With the moon in reverse. This is clarity. The moon talks about secrets. So I feel like somebody here is uncovering somebody's secrets. Figuring somebody out. Somebody found, found out that this person was trying to juggle them. Instead of be honest. Somebody also, instead of juggling, somebody could just be balancing work, love, and life. Give it time. The will is about to turn in your favor. Everything it happens in divine time and let it flow. So don't look. Don't give up. It's about to happen. All right. Do not give up. Somebody is about to get this will turning in their favor. You're going to love it. Somebody is about to be going out, having fun. Your person is coming in. The chariot. So I feel like, yes, yeah, somebody is going to be taking you out. Um, forward movement here. I feel like this person can't wait to come and see you or see you or somebody can't wait to let you know who they are because right now they're spying on you in the background. I really feel like that's this new energy. Right now you're kind of guarded. You're healing. Somebody sees that you're healing. You're guarded. Like you don't take any crap. <laughs> Look, Ten of Pentacles could be a Taurus Virgo Capricorn um, moving on to calmer waters. So I feel like somebody wants to heal things with you. Somebody is moving on the common waters from some type of argument that you guys had. Yeah, Six of Swords talks about peace. Look, somebody is trying to keep the faith and have hope that things will be resolved. Things will get better. The High Priest. This could also be somebody that you know that is kind of guarded towards you. Um, Somebody that you couldn't know from church. This could be somebody from church. Um, a, <laughs> This could be a deacon or something like that or anything like that. But somebody could be watching you. I don't know. Somebody could like you from church or something. Um, but I feel like this is somebody keeping the faith overall. I feel like this could be a family member. Somebody that's trying to believe that things will be better between you and them. Okay. But somebody here definitely wants to talk to you. Somebody wants to give you an equal give and take. Somebody wants to know more about you also. But somebody wants to talk to you. So like... Somebody wants to invest or they had a chance to invest in you and have a relationship with you and they blew it. So somebody blew it here and they, they're sad because you're intuitive. For some of you, you're in this high priestess energy and for some of you, it's a Pisces that is now in a relationship. So they have to move on to common waters because they know they can't get anywhere with you like that. But yeah, it could be an earth sign also that's in a relationship. Um, you told somebody off for sure with this six of wands. I mean, six of swords. I feel like you let somebody know the bit, get the business. Like you told somebody about them, themselves and they had to walk away. You sent them packing and now they're spying on you. Mm -hmm. It's like, I regret everything I did. Dang, I missed them. But oh, well. All right, Virgo, let's see. Let me get you out of here. Let's get one self-love affirmation card. Appreciate all you have. Let go of how you think your life should be and celebrate all that it is. Needing nothing attracts everything. That's exactly what I was telling you. Needing nothing attracts everything. So don't just sit there and wait for anything. Just move like you don't need anything, like you have everything you have. And then by the time you look back, you do. You have everything you wanted. All right, Virgo, I love you and I mean it. Thanks for being here with me, lovies. I will see you on the next video. If you want a personal reading, email me closer. The number two, my destiny is the number one at gmail.com. All right, guys. I love you. Bye.